Hey guys, so it is day one, two, three of my Northern Road trip. And this is Hart. Hi. And we are gonna be doing a photo shoot today, so hence the Bollywood t-shirt. Shout out to Jeevan from Image Surgeons for this. It's so sick, look what he's done. So it's taken a picture taken by Viren. Shout out to Viren Solanke and then like tiled it to make a Bollywood poster and it's in this sick t-shirt so we're gonna do a little shoot today uh, it's gonna be part of my Thirsty and Desire stuff and Hearts is gonna help me it looks amazing I can't thank wait thank you are you excited? yeah we're all excited <laughs> so basically right now what's happening is let me just put you guys here I had to stop vlogging in the car because my dad told me off he sent me a really angry text so <laughs> I had to stop like that there I've made a jail card because part of this is like, this one is for the marriage market. So I am going to be basically be a bride, very urban bride, um, and I'm gonna be sold. So this is the card that I'm about to make. So this one is getting ready. Yeah, just getting ready right now. And it looks like I'm about to start begging. <laughs> like I'm homeless, like a really, Weirdly Desi homeless <laughs> A bride that's homeless. Welcome to my life. Can't wait to do the shoot. Got some graffiti. It looks dope. Is it? Watch this space. <laughs> We've just wrapped up. First part of the shoot, we're gonna do some more? Yeah. I think we will. We should. Um, we should. KFC. And I've broken Harps' crush agility. Tastes so good. We've um, just discovered that inside, can you see it's like tiny, tiny, maybe you can't, like little ice particles. And Harp said, what did you say? It looks like my croquis, which is an Indian dessert, if you didn't know. It's rice pudding basically. Yes. So in here's tiny particles of rice pudding with Oreo. And then wouldn't that make a sick dessert? We need to start Oreo doing it in the good water. Right? Oreo Bay. Get your Oreo Bay we, on. I think we've started to trend right here. And so we've just had a little outfit change in KFC toilets. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Classy, we're keeping it classy. And we are taking some new pictures uh, in another part of Sheffield, right? So we're standing over here. I'm taking pictures of Harps and it's like a guy comes over and he's like, hey, can I have a picture with you? And Harps <laughs> didn't know what to do. I was like, yeah, do it, do it. So we're like trying to take the picture and stuff and then he comes over and no word of a lie, squeezes Harps' midriff squeezes. like this. And we were like, um, I was like, she didn't know what to do so I was going, excuse me, excuse me, it's a bit invasive. I was like, I was so shocked. What do you do in this sort of situation? And then he was like, <laughs> are you too scared? And I said, no, because you're like, why are you coming in her space? <laughs> I was like, And then, the then he went away. So and some guys are weird. Yeah. I'm gonna lie. Don't come up to strangers and ask to take mm -hmm. a picture and squeeze -uh. their midriff. Like, what? What do we? But yes, yeah, so anyway, we're gonna carry on. Um, yeah, no more strangers allowed. <laughs> what bug on me? So many bugs. <laughs> Basically. We are not in Sheffield anymore. We've come to the conclusion, this is Barcelona. We are definitely in Barcelona. It's like so nice and hot. Like, we don't even know where we're going, so it's like being in a different country. There's trams everywhere. It's just insane. And it's beautiful though. Like, it literally feels like we're in a different country. And you know when you're on holiday and like, taking loads of tourist pictures, that's what we're doing. <laughs> but, we're like, yeah. people are joining in our pictures. We've had like, about three different people come up to us and join in. First one, I, when I was doing the bridal shoot, somebody come and said, oh, I'll take a lovely picture with you girls. <laughs> and then, I love the accent. I'm trying. I'm totally not all them. <laughs> and then, um, it, what else happened? Oh, the midriff guy gave a little squeezy squeezy to her. That was mad, that was insane. Weird. That was oh, so you weird. had a guy that actually took a picture with you though. Oh yeah, yeah. straight after Insert that. right here. After cussing <laughs> up, so I got that. So this guy comes over, I'm like on the floor, getting all down and shit with some graffiti in the background. And this guy comes along with a hat on. And, and he's, he's like, like, take a picture, take a picture. And then, then we were laughing our heads off and he ran off. And then he was like, you can delete. You're getting deleted. Uh, what did I say? Now you sound Italian. Now we've got. Well, he was. He was. He had a. He had something yeah, going on. He did on. have a bit of a. But like, then, what did I say to him? I don't remember. Oh, it's calm. It's oh yeah, calm. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's calm. And we say that to this whole time afterwards. <laughs> and I can't remember. It's calm. It's calm. Ah, oh. I love how you go like that though. I switched from being really, really harsh to it's calm. It's calm. It ends. 
It's been so dope today. I just want to say thank you. No, I want to say thank you. Yeah. Everyone, go follow Harps on Play My Harp on Instagram as well. Facebook. Yeah, follow my Instagram and my that. YouTube channel. Yeah, I'll put, like, I'll put it down in the description box. Thanks so much, guys. And make sure you follow me. And follow her. Bye. Peace. So the sissy is home from work now. Are we Hi. going to, where are we going? Capo Lounge. Okay, Capo Lounge. And we've got it up on sat nav because we can't find it and we don't know where it is. It's my first time. And apparently it looks really cool and has good reviews. So we're yeah. gonna check it out. So we're here, we found it finally. And it's really cool inside. Let's show you guys. My voice is going. <coughs> Let's show you guys how cool it is. I love the little kids. And now we have ordered this cocktail. It's called um, Rosie's Tea Party. Tea Garden or something? Tea Party. Something like that. Rosie something. So uh, yeah, let's give it a go. Ooh. This is better chewing gum, for God's sake. Okay, cheers. Right. Wait, I don't want to keep them up. Oh my god, that's so nice. My favourite thing in the whole wide world is this new drink. So we have decided to christen Priya's fire pit right now. And I don't know if we're doing the right thing. Yes. And we're gonna chill outside and try and attempt to recreate Rosie's tea party. See how that goes. We've got some rose, we've got some gin, we've got lemon, but we don't have any elderflower or jasmine. But we've got elderflower tonic. Oh, perfect! Yay! No so we've just knocked up a recreation of Rosie's tea party. We're on FaceTime to Mama. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> and we've got the fire going, and it's time to chill. Not bad for a Monday. Hey, what's up photo boss on here? On me? Yeah. Thanks. Mum's such a oh, WhatsApp stalker. Alright, we'll, we'll continue this conversation with Mum. Bye. Bye. So, I am being the best sister and doing Priya's washing. I've already got a load out there already. Oh my god. So, <laughs> I've got this um, cream on my face for my spots because I'm just breaking out even more. Um, if anybody gets acne, I would recommend trying acne aside. You can get it over the counter in like boots and super dry and stuff. Um, so don't watch this. Basically, I am going to be doing some vlogging. I cannot stop eating these biscuits. They've been in Priya's house for like, God, since she moved here. And they're so good. They're like shortbreads. Uh, I'm drinking out of her favourite mug. She painted this, by the way. We did like a pottery class, and I'm about to check some emails and get on with some vlogging and blogging. Okay, so I've got super bored at home. I did three loads of different washing. Um, I sorted out some computer stuff that I needed to do, and also I made a poster for the next NPA event coming up. NPA is the community organisation that I somebody's car going off oh a nice Range Rover um, but yeah MPA is a community organization that I'm part of and every year we have a charity event and that is really distracting so yeah just made a poster for the charity event it's a Hawaiian theme so that's gonna be really fun in September yeah posted all of that stuff did a bit of social media uh, and now I've come to the designer outlet and let's see if I can buy anything okay so I haven't managed to shop too much I did buy loads of stuff at Beauty Outlet, uh, spent a bit of money there. Um, a lot of the stuff, um, and they had a really nice stiller section. I bought a brush from there um, and also lots of other like cheaper bits. I'm trying not to think about makeup because I've got two horns on my head at the moment. 
uh, that I'm trying to treat till tomorrow, which is Harp's Hermia. No, not Hermia, her Singeet night. Um, and I've just been sat at Starbucks, about to throw some bin and have a look at Marks and Sparks because Priya's on her way. So I've just bought half of Marks and Spencer's and my hair is in my face. Priya's here! Now we're just going into night to have a look and see what's in there. I just bought the sickest Reebok classics ever in the shop, and I'm going to show you. How dope are they? We're all shopped out now, so I've been to Adidas, I've been to the beauty outlet, I've been to Marks and Spencers, I've been to, what's the last place we went before Adidas? That makeup place. No, something else, I bought something else. Oh, the shoe shop, I bought some Reeboks. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, so yeah. nice, I can't wait to wear them. I'm hoping that um, my feet hurt after Harps' wedding and I'll put them on underneath my reception outfit, because they're like gold and really nice. I'll show you them soon. Now we're at Pizza Express, we're gonna get some food. Yeah. Did you know if you have O2 priority on your phone, you can get any Pizza Express meal for Only on Tuesdays though, isn't it? No, in the weekday. Oh. So we're um, cheap getting, getting five pound main meal. Can we put your bag down now? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, we're eating our food. <laughs> And this wasp just came out of nowhere, and we all know how I'm now scared of wasps. I never used to be, but because of, um, if you've watched Yash and Nib's wedding vlog, I got stung by one and had a huge, like, swollen one shoulder because it. A million of them. Yeah, basically, there's a wasp's nest, and now I can't. Um, but to be fair, looking at my face right now, it looks like I've been stung a million times. It's awful. Um, I'm trying to dry these spots out because I just can't have this. Uh, Hot food wedding. Honestly, I, okay, I need to stop touching my face. I need to finish eating my food and right. go home and sort this out. No more wasps. Yeah. Okay, right, so we're back home now. I've cleansed my face and like literally poured tea tree oil onto it. I swear by tea tree oil. It stings for a little bit, but it, it's like a natural way of treating your skin and any of the bacteria that's on your face. So that's what I put on and some acne aside. The tube actually says you should only use it once or twice a day, but I have been putting loads on. Hope in hope that this gets rid of these little craters on my face. So um, yeah, let's do a bit of a shopping haul. So I'll show you what I bought. Okay, first things first, Marks and Spencers. Because I bought a lot of stuff from Marks and Spencers. Okay, so this dress, um, it's just like a long dress with a kind of twist in the middle. I'll show you here. Um, it, it was five pounds from Marks and Spencers. I just thought it was a really nice dress to have um, if I ever go out anywhere. I bought these shoes. Were like eleven pound fifty. They're so nice. They're like little sandals, but like kind of like a shoe. And I bought them in both colours because they're just super cute. I bought some pajamas because my other friend, best friend, is getting married. Um, uh, in August and we have a sort of pre-wedding girly photo shoot to do where we're all just chilling in her room so I thought these would be quite cute to wear there just pajama bottoms and a top um, and then I also bought some pants which you don't need to see I bought some more pajamas these sort of flowery ones which I thought were really cute, and they were five pounds as well. Um, and the top to go with it is just like a pale blue kind of slouchy top thing, cute. And then I also bought my mum some stuff. So this, my mum loves lace. So this kind of lilac um, lace dress top thing, I thought she would find quite cute. She wears leggings a lot, so that would be for mum. Um, and another, little lacy number my mum's two favorite colors black and red okay so beauty stuff here's what I bought I bought um, I actually forgot to pack my um, correcting stuff so I need the green for the moment at the moment because my skin is really red so I bought this color corrector this is quite interesting so it's quite clearly a dupe of benefit and I think it's a W7 brand um, yeah excited to see how this turns out because I really like the uh, Benefit 
um, their real eyes. So absolute lashes may just be a really good dupe. Um, I have got gels on at the moment and I love having gels because they last so long and they feel super smooth but I hate removing them so I thought I'd try this colour which is very similar and it's just a regular polish but this was $1.99 so I thought that was really good. Um, I used my sister's Soap and Glory um, eyeliner pen today. I thought it was really good so I just bought a cheap eyeliner pen and this is by a brand called Royal. I don't know if you can see it, but um, again, $1.99, so hopefully that's good. This um, was a bit more expensive than anything else that I've bought. This was actually $5.99. It's a Stilla silicone double-ended um, eyeliner brush. I always find that um, the brush, eyeliner brush, with bristles can sometimes ruin your eyeliner because a bristle can get out of place. So I wondered if the silicone one is any better, so we'll try that out. And um, I needed some gel remover because I'm running out of the gel remover that I have. So this will help take these off when I'm ready to. And then my Tangle Teaser, I think I left it yesterday in Sheffield when I was doing my photo shoot with Harps. Different Harps, um, it's Harps Nota, not Harps um, Core. Cool. So I bought another Tangle Teaser and again, this was quite a good bargain. So rather than paying almost 13 pounds, I got it for a tenner. Uh, I'll show you what I got from Adidas and literally just some bottoms that I really wanted. Um, they're like joggers with the three stripes, but they're really nice material. They're like um, kind of slinky. Uh, and then from somewhere called Soul Trader, I bought some really nice Reebok Classics. Oh, I can't wait to show you these. How nice are these? Oh, they'll go perfect with anything. They're kind of like a gold, stony, grey colour, but then they've got this awesome metallic on them, which looks sick. So yeah, I'm hoping that um, I might even be able to wear these on Harps' reception underneath my outfit, because it's really long. So yeah, I'm really happy with my purchases. So, I am really hot right now, but I'm all dressed. I've got my brandy in and my full curry suit that helps bought me it's so nice and i can't wait to see all the other girls because they're going to be wearing the same i've got my hair in a plait um my makeup actually looks good on camera but in real life i'm not quite sure because basically we all know i've got a bit of a skin issue so um i used all my new products that i bought um and i literally put green all over my face where there's redness and spots and then i put powder on them to sort of set it then i put my foundation and topped it off with some concealer in the very obvious areas it looks okay i've just gone over it with some um highlighter because i wanted to have a quite a natural look with just um some heavy eyeliner and of course a bright lip and this is the anastasia beverly hills um in i'll tell you the shade It is this one and it is in the shade Rio. So yeah, I really like this one and that's this is the same one that I wore on Harps' juggle as well. So I've got the door open right now because it's really hot and sweaty. But okay, I'm going to turn the car on. No blogging while I'm driving. Listen to your dad. And uh, I'm going to put some bungalow on and get in the mood. Hi guys. Right, so I'm on the way to Harps' Sangi. I've just parked my car. Like, I have to park it on a different road to her house because there's so many cars. But it's like the busiest road ever, but as long as I'm wearing this, I don't think anyone's going to have a problem trying to see me coming because I'm so bright. Um, but yeah, let's uh, finally get there. So, so I got to the house and I had to walk all the way back up the hill again because I forgot Harps' frame. I'm out of breath, I can't even breathe. Woo! Day, what is this? So Saturday, Sunday, M Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Is this Wednesday? No, it's Thursday. Thursday. Day six of the Northern Road Trip. So I am dressed like this with no trousers on, don't watch that. Uh, in Sophie's house. So Sophie's hiding because she's just woke up. Um, <laughs> if you've never seen Sophie or heard of Sophie before, she is my uni best. We had a lot of crazy times together and anything to do with face painting, it's that one. So Henry the Hoover, Bugs Bunny, all that stuff that was, if you've seen any of those pictures, 
day. That's how we used to spend our Friday nights. So yeah, I stayed at Sebby's last Did night, had a catch up. To it. <laughs> I don't think so. We stayed in on Friday nights so that we didn't have to go out and paint we in our face. We went out during the week. Come on. Yeah, went out during the week, but then we'd dress up as Henry the Hoover and knock on all the flat doors to borrow their Hoover funnel. Very, very embarrassing, and um, it's just a story to tell right now. I stayed up till like 3 a.m., I think. We were just chatting. I got here at like 1 after coming back from Harps's and had a little catch up with Sophie and now I'm going to drop her off to go pick up her car and I'm going to go drop mine off and then I'm going to go to Harps's okay, mine. So we have just made a little pit stop so I'm with Fifa now who picked me up from my cousins because I parked my car there um, a little bit of a Starbucks treat and I, sorry I had to do it pick up some breakfast as well so we're on the way to Harps's now honestly I don't think it's that sunny what are you, what is going on? Oh! I thought you were like joking about the weather and not me. No, I'm just trying to say it's not really that sunny. I don't, but they're prescription sunglasses and I feel like I should just wear them at every opportunity. Why not? Let's all be divas. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's get to the mania. Hello everyone. <laughs> you don't know me. Um, my name is Fever and I'm currently being shipped off to Huddersfield with this this kind gal. Look at me with these shades on. This Look morning at her. it was you and now it's me, but it actually is sunny. This is true, it's sunny <laughs> now. Um, so we're on our way. I don't know many Punjabi songs, but I'm being educated. So this one is uh, actually sung by a Welsh person called Nesty Jones. Mesty Jones. Yeah. All oh, right. I bet she speaks better Punjabi than you. Just that is very true. I don't speak Punjabi very well. Um, no, I think you do a grand job. You do. I, th I think you've been helping me a lot. Let's not lie. With the Ladu. With the Ladus. What else have you taught me? You've taught me many things. Full of stuff. Oh my God! This this miracle thing is like a milkshake, but it's got pasta in it. <laughs> So it's like a mixture of pasta and like... Like vermicelli? You call spaghetti? I thought yeah. it was pasta. That, well, that is another word for pasta at the time. Pasta. Okay, so she's, she's taught me about that. Um, I've learned what a giddha is. I've learned why old people make sounds like... <laughs> the beatboxing. Beatboxing. <laughs> like that. <laughs> um, it's been great getting to know you. So it's the morning, the girls arrived last night and we stayed in and watched Love Island with some pizza. I've just done my hair and my makeup, I don't know what I've done. I just kind of pinned everything back because I get so hot, I can't have my hair down, which is terrible. So we are getting all sorry up right now. That's Amy in the background, Amy just Minori doing her makeup. So yeah, we need to get ready. So you can see all the mess that I've made. Priorities, but yeah, so I'm all ready now. I woke up having really good skin this morning, so I'm really happy. I woke up and all my like bumps had gone down, so all I had to do was cover my marks, yay! And I'm wearing my outfit that I wore at my cousin's wedding. And um, we're running a bit late, so we better go. I said the vlog is coming out, we're at the Gurdwara! And here's Shadi Superstar! Yay! <laughs> We've been trying to make this video for like a Yeah, we actually have. We actually have. It's been quite a while. So this is Sophia, who has done all the decoration in Harps' house at the Jaguar. Oh, yes. Like all the props, the umbrellas, yep. the fans, everything. So you need those that good stuff? Yes, we do. So if you need anything, I do actually go out and do everyone's decor. It's just special people. And hopefully this one will get married well. Soon. You know, but I had go all, of that, all those spoons of rice. So. Yes, yeah. So hopefully it should work. Um, and I'm gonna go and decorate her house. Family looking at me. But, <laughs> but if you do need like all like you know the paper flower garlands or any house decor or the tiles or anything, that's check lady. out Shadi Superstore. Dot com. Yeah. Yep, that's right. And there's Amy and Venori. So we're all dressed oh, up now. Hi. 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 Oh, it's recording a video. <laughs> so we just did a self timer, and I am <laughs> way zoomed in right now. So Harps has just got married, and we need to change out of all of this. <laughs> Come on, Minori, pop it! I'm trying! 
The struggle is real. Oh my god, baby. Oh my god. Like literally. Popping bottles. You might need to trim this. Should we, should we swap? I'm about to pop off now. Okay, you ready? <laughs> that was my awful attempt at the top. But <laughs> well, my hair is flying everywhere. Hey guys, I am back at Priya's now. So Harps is married and the wedding was amazing. Um, I'm really sad that it's all over. I have just been making all the vlogs. Um, my laptop is there in a pile of mess right now. I'm just currently taking Priya's recycling out. I'm going to do her shopping and I'm currently still making all the vlogs. Um, I've got oil on my hair. Um, yeah, I made a vlog for that as well. Um, basically, I have been using the Navara Hair Beast and Meraki Skin Oil for my acne. Kindly given to me by Reggie Osan. I don't even know what I'm wearing right now. I literally need to sort my life out and then drive back to Northampton, but time to run errands. Right, well, I am all packed up and ready to leave Panda Palace. Eh, I don't want to go back to work tomorrow. So that's it. My northern road trip comes to an end. Now I am about to drive away from this one. You look like an alu. Sure. Well, I can hardly talk. I look like a rooted alu. You know when the alus grow little roots? <laughs> yeah, look at this cute little panda that I bought for you today. What are you on about this tap right here? You are the flipping panda. Okay. Bye. Okay, so I'll see you back in normal work mode and I'll try to keep vlogging. Had some really nice comments from you all saying like I should keep vlogging and hopefully I can keep doing a bit of a skin update and hopefully I can update you on some of the Meraki oils that Reggie has sent me. So um, yeah, let's look out for some more stuff. Catch you soon. Bye.